Mrs. Burke may have been an agent for the Palmers. In 1856, Ernest Knox owned this house and these lands around here. He was the immediate lesser, and Thomas Palmer was, Palmer was the occupier. Later, Ernest Knox, uh, Ernest McCormick, was here. Yes, the first one I mentioned there was Ernest Knox, 1856. Then um, Ernest McCormick was here. He was related to the McCormicks of Caramore. He was a coal merchant and was involved with the Ted Castles of Dublin. After that, his grandson, Erno Knapp, uh, was here. Where was the first floor? That was it, wasn't it? Yeah, the first floor was the kitchen. Sure. Where was that? The two windows there? Yeah. yeah. I wish you was one of them at the door. Someone in and out. <laughs> <laughs> and all you had in it was an ordinary range, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. yeah. What else was down there underneath? Down here? Yeah. There was a um, rubbish room. Right? A rubbish room, right. How is the else in it? And another room for holding that. Oh, an apple room. An apple room. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's all there was there. Dining room in there. Yeah, what was down here then? Oh, there's an extra. Yeah, further down. And the uh, sitting room. Sitting room down the corner. Yeah. yeah. What are they for? The drawing room is yeah. actually. What are they for overhead then? That's the bedroom. Bedroom. Yeah. And the next one a bedroom. Yeah. And the next one a bedroom. Yeah. All bedrooms overhead. All bedrooms. And then there was a um, storeroom to the back here. Oh, yeah, we'll see that yeah. later. Right. A uh, window on the top part. Oh, that was up in the attic, that. That was the attic? Yeah. And there was two rooms more then. In the attic? Yeah, I think the windows are on the gable, that one. Where did you sleep? I slept in the top one. In the, the attic? The windows were on the gable. Was it in the attic you slept? Yes. Oh. And then there was another room at the end. And oh, there was yeah. another. And one in the centre, but I don't know what that was used for. I never saw it opened. All together. In my time. Yeah. In my time. Yeah. Store room. <laughs> <laughs> what are they storing it? Food and. Oh, food. Well, for buffet, jam. Yeah. Oh, yeah, food. And Naps. a bed. And a bedroom overhead. Yes. And with Mrs. Knapp. Yeah. Well, Mrs. Knapp and uh, Knapp and uh, the other. Kathleen Francis and what, the Gertley, three yes, of them. Right. They were all daughters of Ernest McCormick. Uh, Ernest McCormick. Ernest McCormick. That's right. You didn't see him leave, living here, did you? Ernest. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. So you were here in 1926, was it? Yes. 26, 28. 1928, I left it. Was he here after you? He was. You I don't couldn't say the number here he left. Oh, yeah. yeah. The Steve. chauffeur used to sleep in there. Yeah. Stephen Vance. Yeah. What was the driving? A, 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 a oh. car or a coach? Car. Or had they, did they use coaches here in your time? No. Well, coaches. Oh. Did you use them? The car. Oh, yeah, you were telling me about a Buick, was the it? A Buick, that's right. Yeah. And this was the driveway up here. The driveway now, the road. So you never saw the coach and horses coming up here? No. So that's where the servants were, and oh, that's where you slept? That's where I slept, and the housekeeper was down the second story. Yeah. Just at the back of the house? There's 32 rooms in that house. 32? Yeah. And these are the stables over here? Yeah. What do they keep in there? There was some name now on that stable, so I forget the Coach house? No. Garage? Is this where they kept the car? Yeah. yeah. Care house. No, something else down here in Care House. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 There was uh, Mick McHale, Pat McHale, Jim McHale, oh, yeah. and Tom Collins. 
Да, вот это. 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 Да, George Seeley. He was a steward? Yes. What used to do here? Well, he, he was man and master of everything. Yeah. The do, men, I mean. Do nothing. Yard work and the cows and all that. He didn't do any work at all himself? No. You don't know where he came from? I never found out where he came from. Yeah. He's not in my own men anyway. Yeah, yeah. You don't know when this land was striped, do you? In the thirties, nineteen thirties, was it? Yeah, believe it. Yeah, bought it. Bought it, believe it. No, it wouldn't be bought. The men from Castle McGee that. Yeah, the men from Castle McGee that got the land, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. All right. Castle McGee and four hill people. Uh, Ernest McCormick had three daughters here, Gertie, Kathleen Francis and Mrs. Sharp. Uh, Mrs. Sharp was married to uh, a Navy doctor and then one up was their son. Now the mill I think was down here, I'm told that the mill was down here. Uh, after uh, the, the Irish Land Commission bought and divided this estate among the local tenants of Castle McGee mostly. Down there somewhere is the site of the mill belong to the urban. This is the northern end of the townland now and that's <coughs> Danny Barrett's house and we're uh, looking back towards the fairgreen of yes, Refrain. That's right. Um, and that's from inside the fairgreen wall now from Barrett's house. Well, we're out again now. We're out. Oh, oh yeah, the fairgreen was held inside there, inside that wall. Yeah, that's it. Which is also the boundary wall, too, isn't it? It is, yeah. Oh, that's where the building was held now, isn't it? Yeah, that's the townland boundary then, all the way down. Yeah, the wall was down there and yeah. sun's way up to the left. Yes. Probably built by the farmers of Knoxus. Yeah, more than likely, yeah. Braced you then in the distance, I think. Well, this is the townland now of Black yes. Bank. Fairgreen <coughs> for Raffran. There used to be fairs held here on the 25th of August uh, and the 11th of November. Well, I think originally the 25th of August one would have been on the 22nd because the 22nd was St. Dominic's Day. The story uh, uh, about the French landing, <coughs> there was a fair here on, uh, on the day that it occurred uh, and <coughs> some people are supposed to have left their animals.